These biomedical engineering students are passionate about healthcare and this electronic device weighing in at just under three kilograms is their latest creation. It is called a Neonest and it has been constructed entirely from locally sourced materials. Across the world, over one million preterm babies die and every 40 seconds one preterm baby dies. But it is very hurtful that of these preterm babies who die annually, 99% of them are in low resource settings, countries like Uganda, which are now developing. So we developed the near nest to prevent hypothermia for premature babies during transportation from rural health facilities to referral health centers. Neonatal intensive care units like this are rare in Uganda's rural health centers. <coughs> Medical workers are usually forced to transfer preterm babies to better equipped hospitals and during this process, they can often contract hypothermia. In most cases, such babies are covered with a blanket or placed close to warm water. But after a seven minute charge, this neonest helps to safely move a premature baby into an ambulance where it's then plugged into the ambulance's power system. You have the handles that allow for easy carriage by the people in the NICU into the ambulance. You also have a heating mechanism which is used to warm the baby in order to maintain the temperatures within 36 to 37 degrees Celsius. We have LEDs like lights as a, a safety mechanism to indicate to the hospital personnel to show them that the device is ready for use or there is an error. You also have the blanket and the nest which insulate the baby to ensure that the temperature is maintained inside the neon nest. This device works on a human-centered model. It creates optimum temperatures which ensure steady breathing and blood flow. That lowers the risk of death among premature babies being moved from one hospital to another. In Uganda, 22 babies out of a thousand do not make it through the first month of life. Medical workers, however, believe that the neonest's portability makes it a significant lifesaver. Babies have been taking a long term in NICU, being managed because of a challenge during transportation, because of hypothermia. Now, this innovation is going to happen in such a way that the babies are going to reach in the higher centers with, uh, with the normal temperatures so that the, the management, the stay, the hospital stay is going to be shorter. The Neonest holds a charge for 15 minutes when not connected to power. But the designers plan to install rechargeable batteries. Despite the potentially life-saving innovation, they still face challenges securing funding. But they hope to be in the manufacturing process by 2027, thereby breathing more life into babies across Africa. Darren Alan Cheyune, Africa Matters, Kampala, Central Uganda.